India's hydrogen story is no longer a dream, it's already taking shape right here, right now. Green hydrogen is the fuel of the future. Prime Minister made that announcement on 15th August 2021. We set ourselves a target of producing 5 million tons of green hydrogen annually by 2030. And what once seemed expensive is now becoming possible. India spends $150 billion annually on the import of energy. Tell me if from $3.50 to $3, if it comes down to $2.5 per kilogram, what's going to happen on public policy? The change is already visible. Lassen and Tubro's bid, which I mentioned, for the Indian oil at Panipat was for a 10 KTPA plant at 4.5 kilos. Okior Energy's bid for HPCL at Vishakhapatnam, 5 KTPA plant at 4.39 kilograms. And India's strengths make this transition unstoppable. With low-cost solar power, one of the world's largest synchronous grids, a large domestic demand base and unmatched engineering talent, India is well placed to emerge as a global champion in both production and exports of green hydrogen. Our oil and gas PSUs are stepping up. They plan to build 1 million tons per year of green hydrogen capacity by 2030. Tenders are already out for 42 kilotons per annum, which will soon rise to 170. Pilot projects are underway, 37 hydrogen buses and trucks, 9 refueling stations, across 10 routes. And with 900,000 tons per year of capacity already awarded to 19 companies, India is now aiming to capture 10% of the global hydrogen market. Under the visionary leadership of Prime Minister Narendra Modi, the roadmap is clear, scale up production, bring costs down, enable exports, and build a trusted global hydrogen hub. That hydrogen is not just a fuel of the future, but a pillar of energy security, economic competitiveness, and environmental stewardship.